hey miners in today's video i'll explain you how to mine a new coin which is mona coin so before getting started welcome back to my channel techno savior guys let me just uh, take quickly take you into the official website that is uh, monacoin.org well as you can see here it is the first japanese cryptocurrency uh, taking you further down you can see here a few technical details like uh, which algorithm it uh, runs on. It uses Lyra 2RE algorithm with uh, the block time of around 1.5 minutes and uh, giving a re block reward of around 25 Mona coins. So as you can see, this is uh, the downloading option. Well, uh, these are the different platforms so wherein we can have, uh, we can create our own wallet for the Mona coin. So uh, depending upon the compatibility with your windows, whatever you are using, you can just click on the tab and then start downloading. Uh, well, I have already downloaded. So I'll just uh, take you directly into the software, into the wallet. So let me just minimize this. Yeah. Okay. So as you can see, this is the Monacoin core wallet. So uh, as we are in the first tab you can see here here we can have an overview of uh, the available or the pending mona coins um getting into the second tab uh, okay so if you want to send the mona coins to other people so what you can do is you can put their mona coin address over here and the amount what you want to uh, send it and after uh, typing the amount here you can just click on send So getting into the third tab that is receive okay so here you will give uh, some name uh, like i have given here mining and then click on request payment so uh, address will be generated and which you have to just copy it close and now you can see here uh, address has been created for um, into which my mona coins will be credited in future so if in case you have forgot the ad uh, the address so what you can do is you can just uh, double click on this you will get to know what is the address for this now getting into the last tab that is transactions well as of now i have no transactions so here it is completely nil uh, now getting into the important topic that is uh, how to mine mona coin so we basically need two things first uh, being the mining software and the uh, second is the mining pool so let me just quickly take into the first important thing that is the mining software well you can see here you just get into google and uh, type uh, download cc miner so once you get into it you will find here the official page that is ccminer.org so you just click on that so as you can see this is the software list for uh, the ones who use uh, nvidia graphics card so now what you have to do is you just have to click uh, releases now a new tab opens so depending upon the windows what you're having you just have to click on it and uh, start the download well um i have already uh, downloaded the version compatible to my windows and also since it is uh, the zip file so you have to just extract it this is how it looks after you just extract it so uh, now we have to do the linking between the miner and the pool so what we will do is we will just get into the pool first and create an account over there and later get into the miner and create a bat file and do the linking between two so let me just take you into the pool and then come back here later so guys as you can see here this is uh, the mining pool on the supernova so let me just get down you can see here there are different coins over here so um what I'll do is just uh, control F and okay, Mona is already typed. Yeah, here is the Mona coin. Um, so I'll just click on start mining. Okay, as you can see, uh, a new tab has opened up and uh, here you will find, okay, what you have to do is you just have to uh, sign up. Since you, if you are the first time user, you have to click on sign up and uh, quickly register. Okay, so what you have to do is you just have to type a name over here. Have your uh, 
address your email address I am just giving the ones what I have okay yeah and uh, you have to give a pin and then you have to click on I accept so after filling up all the details what it has asked for you have to click on register now your account has been created okay so now I will just quickly log in So guys, now I have logged in into my uh, pool account. Well, this is the dashboard what you are uh, viewing now. So here you will find all the informations like what is the pool hash rate, what are how many workers are there, um, what is the difficulty level, and what's the price of the coin that is the Mona coin which you are mining at present. And uh, these are the other details as you can see here. Okay, going up now. Okay, so now let me quickly take you into the my account. Um, getting in the first uh, tab edit uh, account uh, okay as you can see here um, okay so here we have all the email address mentioned uh, okay guys so here you can see there is a payment address what it is asking for so here what you have to do is um, earlier we had created a address over here so what you have to do is you just have to double click on it and uh, copy the address let me just close it and you have to control V and paste the address over here so whatever payment is is supposed to be done it will be done to this address so uh, getting into the next option you can see here automatic payout uh, threshold so here suppose for example I just uh, give a value of uh, 3 so once three mona coins has been mined so these many mona coins will be credited to the address what it has been mentioned here so after that after giving all the details you have to give the pin which you had uh, uh, mentioned while creating the account you have to give that pin and then click on update account so I'll just uh, give it quickly and then click on update okay so now my changes has been saved here so this was about the automatic payout so if you want to have a manual payout so what you can do is so uh, the total amount of mona coin uh, which you have received through mining will be displayed here and only that much amount you can cash out only after giving the four digit pin but if you want to uh, have manual cash out every time so what you can do is you can click here zero you can just uh, type zero and by default it becomes manual cash out so now um, this was all about uh, edit account tab so getting into the second tab that is my worker um, guys this is the important tab so well um, as uh, just few minutes before I had mentioned uh, to make a linking between the CC miner and the pool where, well uh, this is uh, the tab where we will be doing the linking so here we uh, first have to have a worker name suppose I give it as take no savior just click on it and uh, I'll give a password sorry take no one two three add new worker and uh, here it gets uh, created so now as you can see uh, the active in the active section that is uh, there is a cross mark well it means that the linking with the CC miner has not been done so I'll just uh, click tick on this so that I can monitor a few things which I'll tell you later so I'll just uh, now click on update workers 
and here you can see worker updated now getting into the third tab that is transactions okay so this is the transaction history page uh, as of now there is no transaction so it's completely empty now so getting into the earnings tab uh, well you can see here uh, as per the time duration here you can see all the details uh, what are the credited bonus everything over here so getting into notifications so it's the normal ones uh, if you want to get notified uh, regarding all these informations you can just uh, tick uh, besides it and uh, click on update and you will be uh, getting notifications regarding all these points okay i'll just select every options and update okay guys so now the most important part that is uh, the linking between the cc miner and the mining pool so for that let's get into help and uh, then getting started okay guys so depending upon the graphics card what you are having nvidia or amd so accordingly you will just uh, copy uh copy it control c okay i have copied the nvidia minor ones okay so guys let me just uh, increase the font size okay hope you can see it now okay so well as you can see here this is the cc minor um this is the address of the mining pool this is the algorithm and here you can see it's the worker login and the worker password so i'll just quickly tell you what to do for this for that uh, we'll just get into uh, account my worker all right so as you can see here you have to just copy the worker login control c all tab and get into the notepad okay so here the web login just before the dot you have to select it and then control v and paste the name what you had created alt tab get over here once again so guys uh, as you can see these two are of same name so it might be a bit confusing for you so what i'll do is i'll just quickly create a different names okay suppose i'll type test password one two three add new worker okay so what i'll do is i'll just click once again on monitor so what we will do is we'll just quickly copy the worker name what we created now alt tab and now we will paste it here yeah done and now you can see here the last is the worker password again get back to the account as you can see here the worker password control c copy it get back over here and then paste it okay so now what we'll do is we will go to file in order to save it so just click on save as and go to the ones where you have extracted your cc miner so now the most important thing for uh, what you have to do is you have to save it in bat format so just uh, type dot bat and then save okay let me just minimize now i'll go into cc minor and here you can see my bat file has been created well guys one more important point to be noted is um, I'll just uh, get back into the notepad here the name mentioned is CC minor well over here you can see it is uh, cross 64 well these two name has to be same so what I'll do is I'll just copy it copy it and get back over here and paste it and once again save it yeah done so uh, now the linking between the cc miner and the mining pool has been completed so now what we can do is the file which we created the bad file what we created now we'll just double click on it and start the mining process 
so as you can see uh, it has detected my three uh, graphics card and it's using now lyra 2v2 algorithm so guys um, as you can see here if you get into this website uh, you will find the optimized version of cc minor so guys this version of cc minor is optimized to mine the lyra algorithm you have to go through the same process like you just have to click and uh, start the download and extract the file so since i have done the extraction already i'll just show you one second you are getting into here yeah so already i have created everything it's exactly the same process I have, as i have explained so i have copied the previous bat file from uh, here and i have copied it here so i'll just double click and start mining so the mining has started as you can see here it is uh, slowly and gradually increasing well my gtx 1070 ti has been detected gtx uh, 10 sorry uh, zotac uh, gtx 1070 msi gtx 1070 so all the three graphics has been detected so i'll show you the overclock settings here okay so this is the first graphics card gtx 1070 so this is the settings what i have uh, been maintaining uh, with the memory clock of around 600 and core clock of around 100 okay so now uh, but if you uh, see the gtx 1070 ti the memory clock is 600 with the core clock of around 200 okay and this is for the gtx 1070 with these all values guys this was all about uh, mining of mona coin so if you think this video was really useful then do not forget to like share and uh, comment on my video and at end do not forget to subscribe to my channel thank you